Hello, everyone. Today we are going to know why does coffee make some people sleep instead of making them awake and focused. Well, subscribe and like this video for more random content. And let's start. Coffee is widely known for its stimulating effects due to the presence of caffeine, a natural stimulant. However, the way coffee affects individuals can vary depending on several factors, including genetics, tolerance, and sensitivity to caffeine. Some people may experience drowsiness or sleepiness after consuming coffee, which can seem counterintuitive. There are a few reasons why this might occur. Caffeine sensitivity. Some individuals are more sensitive to caffeine than others. Even a small amount of caffeine can have a stimulating effect on sensitive individuals, but as the caffeine wears off, they may experience a crash, leading to feelings of sleepiness. Adenosine rebound. Caffeine works by blocking adenosine receptors in the brain. Adenosine is a neurotransmitter that promotes sleep and relaxation. When caffeine wears off, there can be a rebound effect where the body produces more adenosine, leading to a sudden increase in feelings of sleepiness. Timing and dosage. The timing of coffee consumption and the amount of caffeine consumed can also influence its effects. If someone drinks a large amount of coffee close to bedtime, the caffeine may interfere with their ability to fall asleep but once it starts to wear off, they could experience sleepiness. Individual variability. Everyone's body processes caffeine differently. Some people can drink coffee in the evening and have no trouble sleeping, while others may find that even a small cup in the afternoon disrupts their sleep patterns. Caffeine tolerance. Regular coffee drinkers often develop a tolerance to caffeine over time, this means they may need to consume more caffeine to achieve the same stimulating effects, but this can also make them more susceptible to experiencing sleepiness when the caffeine wears off. Stress and anxiety. High levels of stress or anxiety can influence how caffeine affects the body. In some cases, caffeine can exacerbate feelings of nervousness or restlessness, making it difficult to concentrate and potentially leading to drowsiness. To avoid experiencing sleepiness from coffee, Individuals should consider their caffeine sensitivity, timing, and overall caffeine intake. It's also important to be aware of how caffeine affects one's own body and make adjustments accordingly. If someone experiences persistent sleep problems related to caffeine consumption, it may be helpful to reduce or eliminate caffeine from their diet, especially in the hours leading up to bedtime. Consulting with a healthcare professional can provide further guidance on managing caffeine consumption and sleep related issues. Certainly, here are some additional tips and information on managing the effects of caffeine, especially when it comes to sleep. Moderate your caffeine intake. If you're sensitive to caffeine or prone to sleep disturbances, consider reducing your overall caffeine consumption. Try to limit the amount of caffeine you consume and avoid consuming it in the hours leading up to bedtime. Establish a caffeine cutoff time. Aim to stop consuming caffeine at least six hours before your planned bedtime. This allows your body enough time to metabolize and eliminate the caffeine from your system, reducing the risk of sleep disruption. Monitor hidden sources of caffeine. Caffeine is not only found in coffee, but also in various other beverages and foods such as tea, energy drinks, chocolate, and some medications. Be mindful of these hidden sources of caffeine in your diet. Stay hydrated. Dehydration can exacerbate the stimulating effects of caffeine. Make sure to drink plenty of water throughout the day, especially if you're consuming caffeinated beverages. Listen to your body. Pay attention to how caffeine affects you personally. If you notice that even small amounts of caffeine disrupt your sleep or make you feel drowsy, it may be best to avoid it altogether, especially in the evening. Create a relaxing bedtime routine. Incorporate relaxation techniques into your bedtime routine to counteract the potential sleep-disrupting effects of caffeine. Activities such as reading, meditation, or taking a warm bath can help you unwind and prepare for sleep. Consider decaffeinated options. If you enjoy the taste of coffee or tea but want to avoid caffeine, opt for decaffeinated versions. Decaffeinated coffee and tea can provide a similar flavor experience without the stimulating effects. Consult a healthcare professional. If you continue to experience sleep problems or excessive sleepiness despite managing your caffeine intake, it may be helpful to consult a healthcare professional or a sleep specialist. They can provide a more personalized assessment and recommendations for improving your sleep quality. Remember that individual responses to caffeine can vary widely, 
so it's important to find the right balance for your own body. Pay attention to how caffeine affects your sleep patterns and make adjustments accordingly to ensure a good night's rest while still enjoying your favorite caffeinated beverages when appropriate. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you found it informative and entertaining. If you enjoyed what you saw and learned something new, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel for more random content. But our journey doesn't end here. We love hearing from you, so please leave your thoughts, questions, or suggestions in the comments section below. Your feedback is incredibly valuable to us. Don't forget to hit that notification bell so you never miss an update from us. And if you want to dive deeper into topic, check out our related videos right here. Gesture towards suggested videos or links. Remember, keep exploring, keep learning, and keep growing. We'll see you in the next video.